how to create an image gallery in wordpress step by step hey guys welcome back in this video i will be showing you how you can create an image gallery within your wordpress website where you can upload multiple images and showcase your uh, you know media on your website so let's get into it first of all you're gonna open up your wordpress website that you're editing so i have opened up this test website that i have on wordpress and this is actually a restaurant website that i'm working on and i'll show you how to add an image gallery uh, why we want to display multiple images this is actually pretty uh you know important part of a website we need to showcase the images if you have a restaurant website if you have a business website if you have a photography website so you need to add multiple pictures to gain attention and to get more visitors how we can do that so the first step that you need to do is you're gonna actually go to the media section right here and upload all the media uh, from your computer this is where you will upload all the images that you will be using on your website so you can see i have already uploaded some of the images we have this like team images then we have these uh, you know food images for the website how to upload image so you just click on add new and it allows you to draw files to upload or select so the maximum file size can be 100 mb you click on select file and this is where you will upload all the media the footage that you're going to be used because then it will be more easier for you to create a gallery once you have uploaded all of the images then there are different plugins that we can use but i'll show you the easiest way and that is using the simple wordpress editor so you're going to click on your website name, click on visit site and it will take you right here. So this is our website right here. You can see this is one of the page, which is the uh, home page. Then we have about, we have menu and contact. Uh, this is the website that I'm editing. And now what you need to do is you're going to click on customize or you can click on edit page it will allow you to edit different blocks that we have on our page and allow us to add a gallery i'm going to click on edit page and here we are now we're going to click on this plus button at the top which is the toggle block inserter and then it will allow you to add different blocks to your website here we have the text in text you will get the paragraph settings and more you can scroll down to the media section in media section you will find image and then we have the gallery option display multiple images in a rich gallery so you're gonna select this one once you select it it will be added to your website so now we have inserted a gallery to our website drag images and upload new ones or select files from your library now you just have to upload or select the media so we have already uploaded the media so i'm just going to go to the media library and start selecting the images i want to add the images of the food so what i will do is i'll just select the images from here and we're going to click on create new gallery now we can also enter the captions for each image within our gallery for instance i can go with the like this the name of the dish and then what we will do is we'll click on insert gallery so this is going to be the main gallery image so we're going to click on insert and you can see it will be added right here like this this is the one image and now we'll click on add click on open and we'll add more images so we have this one then we're going to go with this one here click on add to gallery and click on add now we have two images again click on add to gallery and select as many images as you like Add to gallery again select this one there you go now you can select multiple images so i will be selecting up to seven to eight images so i'm just going to quickly do that and select them you just have to click on add to gallery and select the media that is why i said that if you upload the media first then it will become easier to create a gallery instead of uploading every time but if you still want to upload more then you can just go to the upload file here and upload a file uh, from your computer so we'll just select this one click on add to gallery and one more like this perfect so now i have added all of the images that i wanted to add to my gallery now i can again add captions to them uh, all of them one by one and you can select one of the images and edit it out so if you want to add an old text to the image you can do that it will also show you the image size and everything then we have a caption description and the file url 
click on update gallery and now your gallery will have more than one image. Now you can see we have like the image gallery. This is the image gallery that we just created. It has eight images like this. So if you want to keep uh, it, you know, like this, for instance, we had uh, the first one, we have three and then we have two. So let me actually upload one more so that it's more aligned, but it will adjust the layout according to the website and it will look really good. You can see the images look pretty good and the caption will be shown like this. You can see the caption also is very impressive and it gives us this, uh, you know, look of different categories. Now, what I will do is I will just upload one more image. So you're going to select it and then so we're going to select the gallery, click on add, uh, open media library, and I'm just going to upload one more image like this. Click on add to gallery here and update. So now my gallery has nine images and this is what it looks like. This is how you can update your gallery on WordPress. You don't need to actually add any plugin or uh, anything because within your WordPress, you can simply add an image gallery and showcase the pictures you want to. So this is how you create an image gallery on WordPress. It's actually really easy. You can also, uh, if you are using WordPress with Elementor, you can also add it with that. And it also allows you to add it, add a gallery. But this is actually the simplest way and the easiest way for free how you can add a gallery on WordPress. It's really easy and I hope now you understand how to upload the images and how you will be able to align them. Now, if you want to uh, replace any image, if you feel like, okay, I need to crop or something like that, if you want to apply a duotone filter, you can do that. If you want to replace any image, we have the option right here. And then we have these three dots that allow us to show more settings. Then we have select parent blog, copy, duplicate, edit HTML, and then we have remove image option as well. So you can see all of these uh, images will be updated like this. And you can also give your, uh, you know, page a name. So this is like the home page where we had the gallery, but I can, of course, customize it. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go with maybe like food. So you can add a title for your gallery. Once it's updated, you can just click on the save option and you will be able to then preview uh, your page. So I'm going to click on preview and let's get a desktop preview and preview in a new tab. Let's actually do that and let me show you how our gallery is looking like. Okay, perfect. You can see this is our gallery page and it looks so good, all of the images. So if you want to create a restaurant website like this, if you have a photography website, then this kind of layout will be really good for you. Um, again, if you just want to go for two images, you can go for two if you want to add more. So it will adjust the size according to that. And we can also, uh, you know, click right here and it gives us the align option. So it's none. Then we have full width, align left, center or more. So if I click on align center, then that means all of the images will be centered aligned. But I can just simply go to none so that it's kind of like simple according to the layout that is being set. So this is how you can upload and create a gallery within your WordPress website. It's really easy. You can upload your media freely uh, by just going to the media section here and upload all the files and then create a gallery and add those files to that gallery. I hope that I was a big help to you guys. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, turn on bell notification and subscribe to YouTube channel.